Welcome back into SWH Live. Chris Treft with you here. George Brown will join me shortly. Start of this one, Pablo Beta Golden Knights in these amazing new red uniforms. Going up against Connix. Connix is a much improved roster. If you, if you break down this entire roster, they've struggled the last little bit in the Palma Pro. But man, they have loaded up some more guys on the roster for this one. And it's going to be a formidable opponent. It's certainly not going to be like the last couple years when they've really struggled. I don't expect that to happen with the roster they've put together. As the Golden Knights have possession. Travis Snow into the zone. He shoots. That one's blocked. And then you have a great goalie like Kevin Dwyer backstopping you. I mean, he's going to give you a chance in every game. Here comes Purcell. Gets it down low. A chance for Connick. Shot save made. It's TNT. Stymies that one. Two big benches here. This puck comes back into the zone. Purcell has it. Pass up ahead. It's Connix setting up the four check here. Puck bounces to the far corner. I'm going to tell you folks, I'm going to have a heck of a time with these Connix jerseys. I'm not saying they're bad jerseys, but I can't read the numbers at all. So I'm just going to be guessing here at times. Long pass. That one is deflected wide of TNT's net. Now Mooney, as I mentioned earlier, playing on different teams, the Mooney brothers, which don't see too often. Now here's Palma back the other way. Dwyer shot. That one is stopped. Connix heading the other way. Chabera getting into it with one of the Connix back checkers. And Connix will reset. Up to the far side. And it comes out high. Played back into the Connix zone. Palma on the four check, trying to come away with that as John Seymour had it knocked away. Now Connix back to the way, shot. Tar Taglioni makes the save and sends it up ahead to John Seymour. Here he comes screaming down the left wing. John John, inside outside, he's forced to the corner. Puck comes back for Garrett Haar. Jared Hart, pass to the left wing side. Seymour gets it back to the right wrist shot. That one goes wide. Comes all the way back into the Connick zone. Connick's offensive zone. Buck knocked away. Garrett Haar has it. Now back the other direction. John Seymour moves to the left wing. Buck comes in behind the net. in behind the goal. As I'm going to take a break. i got a few things to do for the NHL draft, trying to get set for the USHL stuff. But George Brown is taking you away on play-by-play -play for a few minutes. Just make sure you make sure you just make sure you make sure. Just make sure you let me know when that first pick comes in. I guarantee it's going to be USHL guy Owen Power. Yeah. Going to the Sabres. Yeah. Great kid. I met him when he was in Chicago last year. Great oh, kid. there's a huge Holy hit moly. along the boards. And there's a call coming up now as Junior Caniz is taken out. Caniz is not the type of guy that's going to retaliate, 
but he did take a hit, and that's a body check, and it looks like Glover's gonna go to the box. But thank you again, Chris Treft, all your hard work. It's awesome on the broadcast with you. And Chris, and if, if you wanna know, folks, you wanna know somebody that's doing some big things. Chris is working with the USHL, he's working for the NHL, he's doing a great job. So I am always happy to cover for my guy, who's not only a great broadcaster, but a great friend. So. That's what friends do. That's what friends are. That's what friends are for in good times. At Stay Wars, I'll be on your side forevermore. But anyways, sorry, guys. That's the entertainment for today. Goddick's trying to kill off this penalty. We are scoreless five minutes in. Buck wrapped around on the boards. Connix will get to it. Still holding possession. It's Baumgartner. Sent up ahead now off the boards. 247s doing battle with each other. It's Baumgart Baumgartner for Connix and Kyle Mayhew for the Golden Knights. It's Cadiz, it's Travis Snow, it's Mayhew with the puck now. Mayhew comes in, fires that one, it's blocked at the defense by Baumgartner. Baumgartner has it, Baumgartner pumps it into the corner and he'll carry on with it off the boards. And Mayhew does battle in there. With I believe that's Kyle Phelps. No, it's not. I've got to get that number. Okay, there's Kyle Phelps. You can't see these numbers on Connick's, George. Right, we're right, be, right. We're going to be guessing. I mean, I'm kind of used to that. I've had jerseys like that before. Yeah. So, all oh, thrown right back into the corner here. Back up to no. No to Mayhew. Mayhew gets it down low. All injured with it. Back to Mayhew. Mayhew, no, no. Fires one wide. Five seconds left in the power play. Mayhew has it once more. Mayhew, Olinger walks in, fires it wide. Travis Snow as we return to even strength. No has it. Walks it up. Gets it across to Cadiz. Fires one, blocked away. Connix makes changes. Both teams make changes. Brought forward. R got that shot off, and it's saved by Dwyer. Garrett Hart took that one in. Now it's Ethan Chavera leaving it back there. Ethan takes a return feed, poked away by Dwyer, and turned over to Glover. Collision there. Along the wall. It's taken now by Purcell. Purcell up on the wing. It's a two on one for Connix. They come in. Here's a chance. A shot saved by Tommy Tartaglioni. It goes up and off the glass, and it's recovered once more. Connix has it again, left in the slot. That shot stopped Purcell with the chance there. Ethan Chavera wants to start away. Chavera. Varela goes off for a change. Chavera's checked, but it comes right to. Chavari, is that, is that Daniel? Yes, it is, all right. Didn't look at the number, just saw the face. Wanted to make sure I got the right person. It's Chavira. Chavira fitted in front, the backhand scores. Kevin Mooney this time pokes it home on the feed from Chavira. Looks like the RHL Golden Knights are behind the Golden Knight bench. It's good building organizations here in our roller hockey community. I like it. Just don't sit behind us if we play Palma. Kidding. <laughs> Kidding. I kid. Face-off control by Connix. They trail 1-0. Up on the wing, that pass goes. Cooper Har. Tommy T out of the net. Plays it off the board. Spinorama plays that. And it's taken out of John Seamer. Seamer leaves it there. Tyler Gonzalez. Ball on the wing at Javeri. Javeri to Seamer. Seamer looking, firing, blocked away. That's one thing Connix is going to do all game. They can block shots tremendously. And they will get it done. Starting back now is Echeverry. 
Left there. For Mayhew. Around on the boards. And it's fired back into their own end. It'll be Seymour recovering. Seymour in behind his own net. Seymour steps it forward. Crosses the red line. Seymour leaves it there to Cadiz. Cadiz takes the shot. Dwyer makes the save. Lies in front of the net. Phelps, he can't get to it. To what's taken now. Jordan Thomas plays it back into his own end. And it's Junior Cadiz recovering. Travis Snow with possession of the puck. Plays it back to Jordan Thomas in behind Tommy Tartaglioni up on the wing to Travis Snow. No. Olinger in behind to Cadiz. Cadiz tried to get it back to Olinger. That eludes everyone. And Jordan Thomas thought twice about coming up. Kyle Phelps carries on. Phelps on his backhand. Tommy Tartaglioni stops it. Never wants a whistle. And Cadiz has it. Cadiz will carry on now. Cadiz gets over the red line. Curls back. Plays it to Jordan Thomas. Travis Snow now with the puck. No, leaves it there. It's Allinger again. That one's broken up, but Travis No recovers this one. Stepping up ahead is Glover. Glover to the outside, defended by Thomas, taken out of the play. Around the outside. Kevin Mooney playing it back in zone end, fighting off a check from Jared Gerger. Ethan Chavera wants to get things going now. He'll step away. Up on the wing. Mayhew fires, save in there. By Dwyer. It's funny watching Mayhew and Mooney playing against the team that they've played on for so long. Tommy Tartaglioni makes the save there. Because they've played on Connex for a while. And, you know, sometimes teams retool. one nothing game here right now. Golden Knights lead. 6.20 left in the first period. Tillotson plays it back into his own end. Gerger has the puck at center. Gerger looks up ahead. Good feed there. That one's tipped off the glass. That's Alex McDonald battling for it. McDonald plays it back to his own end, Eric Purcell. It's Purcell, Tillotson, Gerger, and Amac on the rink right now. Up ahead, there's a chance, a shot over top of the net. Comes off the glass to Purcell. Purcell plays it up ahead. Purcell has it, takes that shot, scores! If I am correct, that's 61 Eric Purcell. I believe, I, I can't see the face down there. I thought it was Purcell. It looked like 61 who scored the goal, but if it was not, I beg your pardon. If it was 91, it's Chris Rockman. And that's who it is, it's Rockman. Rockman got the goal. Now a penalty's coming up to the Golden Knights, and I apologize, I froze there for a minute because I'm trying to see 
if it was Purcell or Rockman, I couldn't tell the six or the nine, but I do know both players. It was Rockman who got the goal. It'll be updated online, I'm sure, in a second here. But in any event, it's 1-1. Five minutes left in the first, and now Connick will go to the power play. Chasing after the Seamer on the power, shorthanded. It's Purcell up top. That shot fired wide. Brandon Glover here on the left side. Purcell on the right side. Down low is Gerger and also Rockman. Rockman, Glover, Glover, Purcell. Purcell fires, that one's over, off of a skate. Trying to poke it ahead, it's kicked ahead to Seamer. Seamer gonna go. Seamer in alone, short-handed. John Seamer fakes the shot, scores! Seamer kicks it. Leg fake, scores the goal on Kevin Dwyer. It's a short-handed goal, it's one you do not like to see if you're on that Connex bench, a power play that you get scored on. Face-off controlled here now by the Golden Knights. Cleared in front. Taking a Purcell. Purcell. Rockman. McDonald, I beg your pardon. Now Rockman. Rockman. McDonald. Rockman. 20 seconds left in the penalty. Back to McDonald. McDonald looks down low. Got it to Gerger. Took the shot. Tartaglia only made the save. Gerger. Back to McDonald. Rockman. Rockman. McDonald. McDonald. Rockman. One timer over top of the net. Penalty is now over. Purcell has it. Purcell gets it to Rockman. Rockman will reset things. Puck possession lies with Cadiz and Thomas of the Golden Knights right now. Floated to Mayhew. Mayhew plays it to No. Turned over. Baumgartner sends it in front. It's broken up by Echeverry. Travis No has it in behind the net. No plays it up to Cadiz. Cadiz has it back to Mayhew. Mayhew off the boards. Cadiz. Cadiz to know. Now Cadiz wants to start out. Cadiz comes through. Cadiz to his backhand off the boards and plays it all the way back to Mayhew. Under two left now here in the first period. Mayhew has possession of the puck. Plays it back now to Cadiz. Cadiz at Javeri. Travis Snow. Cadiz steps through. Junior Cadiz takes that shot blocked at the defense. No plays it back to Cadiz in the corner. Cadiz plays it back all the way into his own end. At Javeri will be the first one there. Ethan Javera has it, tried to bounce it off Kevin Dwyer, didn't work for him. Tillotson 
Now turns. Hunter Tillotson. Going to E. Plays back into his own end. Tommy Tui halts back there. Tui wants to go and gets it up to Tillotson. Tillotson floated that one wide of the net. Tui will play it in behind his own net. 30 seconds now left. Haley turned over. Haar is going to be the first one there as he read that play. Cooper Haar turns. Haar with 15 seconds left in the period. Plays it to Shavira. Ethan Shavira drags that one off the post and out the other side. Rockman plays it now. Tillotson will pick it up with five seconds left. Dumps it in on Tommy T, and that'll be the period. Tommy T dumps it all the way down. And that's it after one. The score is two to one. Pamela Beta Golden Knights up on Connex. We'll step away and come back with second period action here on SWH Live. Our dollar signs. The overcharger can charge for expensive car repairs because your warranty expired and there's nothing you can do about it. Overcharging your days are done. Woo! The Ninja Boys teamed up with Car Shield, the Bill Lauren, mechanic of your choosing, Auto Avenger, and we're treating bullies like him to a buffet of woo! Car Shield cars go farther. Woo! Folks, I want to apologize. I'm just getting around to a bunch of the messages that I had. Instagram, we got some updates on Puglisi, who was phenomenal in that game, Futures in Black Ice. He's uh, on the Camographs squad, and they hit me up to let me know some of the history for him, and kid's just awesome. Ron Best also hit me up and said that Mayhew played on Rink Rat, not Connix. I didn't believe I said that he was on Connix. I thought it was Purcell and Mooney I said was on Connix. I don't believe I said Mayhew. But if I did, I misspoke. And I apologize. There's a shot. Travis No broke his stick. Here's a chance now. And Phelps between the legs. Tommy Tartaglia only makes a stop there. Plays it up ahead to John Seamer. Poked away. Omgardner starts back. Takes that shot over top of the net. Comes in behind to Jordan Thomas now. <laughs> Comes back to Mayhew. Kevin O'Brien, who the message I just opened, you got me dying over here, guy. You got me dying over here. But anyways, that'll stay in my inbox. It's a funny one. I'll have to show Treft. Stepping ahead is Mayhew. Mayhew fed it through to Seamer, wasn't expecting it. And it's off the boards now. Rockman gives chase. 
Jared Gerger, I beg your pardon. These numbers are brutal to read. Echeverry turns, leaves it for Seymour. Seymour steps through. Seymour looks. Seymour will turn back into his own end. Echeverry walks it through now. Forehand shot. Dwyer makes the save. It's recovered by Tillotson. Tillotson recovers in behind the net. Leaves it for Matt Herter. Now Tillotson has it and would like to set things up. Cooper Haar with the puck. Cooper Haar behind Dwyer now. Our halts back there. Up ahead. That's Tui. Back to Har. Har looks back. Throws it back to Tui. Top of the zone. Sent rink wide. And Tui takes it right back. Tui steps out. Hits it on the wing. And Connick steps back. It's Herter. Herter turns on the wall. Cooper Hard defends him. Kept down low there. They'll all do battle in the corner. Baumgartner fanned on, fanned on that one. Tillotson tries to take it away and does. Tillotson comes in, kicks it to himself. Saved by Tommy Tartaglioni. Shavera wants to start away. Shavera and no. Come back. Shavera with it. Poked away. Great play by Tui. That's not no. I beg your pardon. That's Kevin Mooney. Tui takes it back now. Tui around on the boards. Turned over, though. Red Olinger lost control. Ethan Chavera has it. Chavera plays it to Olinger. Fires one off the post. Comes back here now. Back in front, and that one's tipped away at the defense. Connix wants to start up, and they do. Sent all the way back to Eric Purcell. In his defensive end, in behind Kevin Dwyer. Alex McDonald walks it through. McDonald, poke checked away. Great play by Olinger. Olinger picks it up ahead to Cadiz. Cadiz off his own skate and it eludes himself. And McDonald plays it back but gives it away to Cadiz. Cadiz. No. Shot. Saved by Dwyer. Sent all the way back for Tommy Tartaglioni to get. And back come the Golden Knights. Mayhew steps forward to Travis No. No, tried to fit it through to Mayhew. Couldn't do it. No plays it all the way back into his own end. Tartaglioni plays it off the boards. That's a very picks it up. Javeri plays it back to Cadiz. 2-1 is your score. Golden Knights in the lead. That Javeri with the puck now. Javeri to No. No has possession of the puck. No looks. Curls back. Has Cadiz in the corner. In his own end. Cadiz will step out with it. Cadiz walks it up off the side of the net. Cadiz regains control of the puck. Gets it up to Echeverry. Tried to get it back door to Seymour. That didn't work. Comes back to Cadiz now. And Dwyer makes a save. Echeverry with a chance. And he'll hang on for a faceoff. Two to one is your score. It is a Connix lead. Racing after is Cooper Haar. Tried to get that back and off over top of the net. Seymour racing after it, it's poked away. 
Hart tries to turn on it. Everybody's trying to turn on it, but stepping back with it, it's going to be Connix to start away with it. That is Paul Linder. Linder turns in behind Dwyer. 11 minutes left in the second period. Lots of time here in a one-goal game. Linder steps forward. Comes at that shot, deflected up and out of play. Matt Herter took that shot. Faceoff coming up to the left of Tommy Tartaglione. TNT, they call him. Call them TNT. I actually sounded like the guy real quick there. Maybe not. Who knows? Face-off controlled by Connix and back to their own end. Set up ahead, and here's a chance. McDonald wants to start back. There's a shot. Oh, fool Tartaglione, but he almost falls, and he gets a whistle. off to the right of TNT. Shots are 10-10, but on the big board, it's a one-goal game. The Golden Knights lead. Thomas cuts to the middle, broken up by Alex McDonald. Baumgartner, I beg your pardon, that's 47. Herder's in behind his own net. Played back. By Henderson. Connick starts away. Henderson plays it back to Tui. Back in their own zone. It's Tui again. Tui to Henderson to Tui. Henderson has it now. Back to Tommy Tui. So he leaves it there, and back comes Gerger. It's Jared Gerger coming in over the red line. Gerger to the outside. Gerger looks, trying to clear it in front. Palma starts back. Here's a shot over top of the net, taken by Olinger. Recovering Olinger, tried to get it again. That time it was from Kevin Mooney. Mooney has it again. Mooney tried to clear it in front, broken up. Sent all the way back into their own end. And it'll be picked up by Delfino Varela. Varela, Cooper Haar. Haar comes through. Varela was tapping for it, but Cooper Haar made the safe play and got it back to John Seymour's own end. Cooper Haar waits behind his own net. 8.20 now left, gets it up on the wing, and here they go, it's Seamer. Seamer takes that shot, Dwyer makes the save, it's poked away, Purcell has it. Purcell wants to go. Purcell cuts in, takes that shot, it's deflected wide. Comes back and there's a penalty coming up, high sticking penalty it might be. Connick will take it back and set it up. Recovering now is Glover. Glover has possession, leaves it for Purcell. So now they've crossed the red line, they can't go back behind. To Jared Gerger, Gerger fires one deflected wide. Back, Georgie. Comes back now. So a power play here for Connix. This is huge as Garrett Haar heads to the penalty box. So 
was a huge moment in this game. A one goal hockey game, 740 left in the second period. And a power play here for Connick's George. Yes, sir. So Trefty's back as you can see, because that's not my voice totally. But a power play coming up to tie this game, Treft, in a pool A matchup. After this game, every team in pool A would have played. And that's huge. And we're starting to see things pan out after one game. A couple of, okay, yeah, we expected that. A couple of huge, oh no, we did not see that yeah, coming. For sure. I guess that's the name of the game. Big power play here for Connix. And they win the face off. They got the box set up and they're working it around. Remember, John Seymour has a shorthanded goal on this one. We have a collision in front, TNT's dancing all over the place, shot, and they score! And that needs to be a goal. That's a great call. And I don't give refs much credit, but that is a great call. No, you do not. Mama is incensed, and now the referees are talking to each well, other. Th that call's not changing, because Tommy Tartaglioni, and both referees know it, Tommy Tartaglioni came out Tommy challenges a lot. He came way out and actually took the defender out instead of him getting taken out. Yeah, I mean, he kind of did it to himself for yeah, lack of a better that's, word. That's when the puck's still lying down there next to Tommy. Do not expect Tommy Tartaglioni to shoot that puck down. Then he tried to give a blocker to the head of whoever was in front. I missed it. Can we, can we cue that up, guys, for me? Can we cue that up so I can take a look at that play next whistle? I do want to take a look at that play next whistle. Because I do want to see how far he was out. And Taglioni still chirping, but it's 2-2. There's a turnover there, and Connix has possession of the puck now. Big moment in this game is Palma has to catch their breaths yeah. because they're frustrated. Whether it was a good call or bad, they're going to be angry. You know the hardest thing? Doing play-by-play -play and going back, because I'm like, all right, face off. <laughs> going backwards. <laughs> and Connix is like, oh, yeah, yeah, let's face it off while they're yelling and screaming. Let's go, let's go, right. let's go hurry Heck up. Yeah. But granted, I've been, I've been watching this game, just rejoining the call, so I don't think I was just hanging out here. But um, it's been a fun game. And I said it in the pregame before you got on, George. Connix is going to be much better. I don't want to say the last two years were flukes, as we have our first warning for holding the puck behind the net. You only have 10 seconds or you have to move it. That oh, Palma right. Pro. So now both teams get a warning. If it happens again, it's a penalty, even if Palma does it. That's a little cork in that this. Is if correct. Palma holds it, it's still a penalty. Because they've warned both teams. Off one by Palma here. That's kind of big too because it took face off one by Palma, so it took possession away from. It's like a jump ball here. It took possession away from from Connix. Well, every face off is like a jump ball, right, George? Absolutely. Cadiz, right wing side. Wraps on the back of the net. That's a that's a trip missed. Are you, are you sure? It looked like he stepped on the puck to me, George. Nah, that's a trip missed. Well, you heard it from George. He passed out low. Shot goes wide of the net. That would have probably got uh, I, I, I won't Palma say all fired up if that one would have missed. In on a chance. Big hit. Shot hits the post. And then ends up behind the net. Close chance for Palma, but it goes for none. But the play had already gone. The shot had already been taken. It, it shouldn't have been a call, so I can't say missed. It was a trip. But I don't think you call that anyways. The puck, the play had already happened. No, that's what that's why I was saying. I, I wasn't going to give him too much grief on that one. Nah, not at all. Not at all. But, George, let's be honest. If that play happened against you, that goal, you're going to be mad, right? No. Really? No, I'm going to be furious that the goal happened, and I'm going to give it to the referee. But knowing in the back of my mind, like, 
know what I mean? Yeah, you're just doing it to, to do it. To I've got to do my job plant, because you've got to plant the seed. But Nothing wrong with doing a little planting. It's almost strawberry season, George. Here comes Connix. This puck sent to the middle. It's traffic in front and obtaining possession will be Palma, but they turn it right over. They've had about four turnovers in the last minute and a half here. Yeah. Off topic, Seth Jones just got traded to Chicago. Here comes Ethan Chavera. From Columbus, right? Yes. That was kind of a, the worst kept secret, though. They knew it was going to happen. It's just what the return was going to be. I don't like that line change there. Here comes a chance for Palma. And Kevin Dwyer, the excellent save. It's a tough line change. Palma has possession of the puck in the defensive end, in the offensive zone, and you make the line change, it's a tough one. Unless he was injured. Hey, Dwyer has played very well in this game. Yes, he has. At, at Tours, I know his confidence got a little low. He played one game for the Mudcats against you guys, and he had no help. And you guys lit him up, and he didn't play after that. And so coming into this one, I mean, there's two ways to look at it. He could have got down on himself, or he could come out and have a great performance and show everyone that that was just, you know, one game where his defense wasn't great and in front won, of him. he won top goalie at Naritz as well. Yeah, and so he, uh, he definitely re responded in the proper way. Here's Palma, shot, they score! Unbelievable shot to the top shelf. Tyler Gonzalez planted that one on a great feed by Seema. You know, Tegon, he gets a one-timer opportunity. He's going to take full advantage of it. And that is a tough one-timer to do when you're going as fast as he was. But he made that look easy. Pinpoint accuracy, top shelf. Do we still have that goal queued up? The uh, goal that was, I still want to, next stop, I just still want to see that uh, goal that Palma was screaming about. All right, Palma back to the lead, and they have possession with 3.48 left in the second. That's a huge dagger to Connix because they had momentum. An errant turnover leads to a Tyler Gonzalez one-time blast and a Palma lead. Still plenty of time. Connix has shown a lot of resiliency in this game come, coming back. So can they continue it? Bollinger, bringing the puck up, gives it to Tino. Travis Snow, many say, is the best player in roller hockey as that puck goes up and out of play. Shot it right in his own bench. Almost took Clay Taylor out. I know George Brown doesn't disagree with that. He's easily top five. No one's going to disagree with that. For sure. Absolutely. But best overall player, if there's an MVP ballot, I mean, he would be He'd be first, second, or third in probably every single one. That's how good he's been. And he's such a great guy, too. So it really helps with talking about how great he is. That is true. <laughs> because he's humble. He's an amazing human, great family. Under three left here, trapped in an evenly matched game. 3-2, shot for 13 all. And so we have possession going to Connix. Pass comes up the right side. See if they get some more traffic in front of TNT. You know he's going to be a little bit rattled. Yeah. I mean, granted, you get within five feet of him, and he's a little bit rattled. But TNT loves the old goalie slash. My for one is not going to be standing in his crease if I play him anytime soon. Oh, we are turnover. A chance in front. Dwyer. Great poke. But where is Connick going? Jack. They're leaving so early. They're leaving the zone so early. Here comes Purcell. That one's knocked away from him. Connix with another penalty. Here comes Trevera the other way. Shot. That one is blocked. Great block. Two on two as Connix comes up. Make it a three on two. Bucks in towards the front of the net. Purcell gets taken down again. So tag, we already took him down. Up for Eton. Eton in. Tries a backhander. And he's forced off the puck. Trevera wanted a call. Kind of exaggerating there. That one's knocked away. They're pulling. They're pulling now. Gerger. 
Gets the puck over. He's open. They get it to Gerger. Fakes the shot. Cuts left. Shoots. Slides it along the floor and just misses. They'll set things up. Minute and a half left here, Treft. Here we go. Pass comes to the right side. Rashad to oh. score! And Tommy Tartaglione points at himself and says, my fault. He was caught leaning. He was concentrating on the man in front of the net. And Tommy says, my fault. And that is a huge goal. I think TNT just didn't expect a shot to come. If he was kind of yeah, hanging you, out in the middle. Why wouldn't you? If you look at it. I mean, he just, it just, he like jumped the wrong way. We'll see here it comes. Look here. at it. Look at it. So he's cheating. Worries about the guy in front instead of letting his defenders worry about it. And he's cheating there. And then the man in front gives it to him. But, well, 3-3. Three, three, 120 left. Who's going to make the last mistake? Well, we see our first shootout, George. We're close. Travis Snow says, I don't want no dang shootout. I'll win it in regulation. Here he comes. Travis Snow around the outside. Tried to cut to the front in a desperation poke check. Knocks it away. Connix with the puck. Here they come. It's a one-on-one -on -one rush. Power move to the outside. TNT with a poke check. That was risky because he might have tripped him there. Yeah, but you got to keep possession there. Now back the other way. A chance. Cadiz hauled down. No call. Palma. Oh, they're not calling that. Listen. You, if, Once a call. If you're Connix and you're taking the puck down there. Now a chance in front. No, tries to go through four players. It's knocked away last You don't want to force. You don't want to keep possession up. Mate. But, man, you had nothing. They had you going all the way outside. Keep going with that and keep possession. It almost cost him. 22 seconds to go. Palma has the puck going for last shot, NBA style here. Travis Snow and shoots! Missed it just past the right post. That was close, George. 13 left, 13 left. We had it in the bird's eye view up here. And that, Chris, we're going to shoot out. One sounds, and that will do it. All right, George, if you're the coach, who are you going with on each team? I don't know. Man, <laughs> it's, they're so talented here, man. I'm probably thinking you're probably going to see, on the Connick side, you're probably going to see uh, <clears throat> maybe a Baumgartner, Gerger, Purcell, or Phelps. I'll give you four. It's just Alex, I don't know. You got Olinger, Seamer, Travis No, Ethan on the other side. This is what they play the games for, folks, and this is why they add the shoot. This is why we add the shootout. John John Seamer grabs the puck for Palma, speeding right down the middle. Seamer fakes back in for it. Dwyer makes the save. Big save by Dwyze. Wow. Bachman here. Bachman's first try, tries five-fold. TNT says no. Zero to zero after the first inning. And now it's Travis No. Inning, huh? No, in, for it, shot, he scores! What do you know? Travis Snow, top well, I shelf. I mean, what are you going to do about that shot? I mean, you can't do much of anything in that shot. You can't stop him. You can only hope to contain him. And in a shootout, there's really nothing you can do. Tell me about Here's it. Here's Purcell. Trying to even it up after round one. Purcell shoots! TNT, the old school pad stack, makes the stop. And after two rounds, or innings, it's 1-0 Palma. They can win it here. Junior Cadiz for the win. No. Oh, my. Almost spoke too soon. Dwyer made the save. It rolled to the goal line, and Dwyer got back on and it. And you heard a collective, whoa. Whoa. Here's Jared Gerger. I was right. I got three out of, well, 
Here's Gerger against TNT to keep the shit alive. Backhand shot to Taglioni! Are you kidding me? Cue that up, cue that up for me, cue that up for me, cue that up for me if you can. If we can cue that up, I want to see that. And if we can stop it right when he grabs the puck with his glove. Oh my goodness. Not only to make the save, George. So you're about to see this. But to keep it above the goal line. And can we stop it right? And I think he did. But can we stop it when this puck gets into his glove? Yeah, great <laughs> save by Tartaglioni. <laughs> Great save by Tartaglioni. That's great. And the right call by the referee. Huge call. Do we still have that goal queued up with the goaltender interference? If we do, can I see that, please? Because I want to see that. And I'm going to have you stop it at a certain moment, if you can. I just want to see that goal. Wow. I'm talking about the goal that was... The goaltender interference goal. I don't, I don't know if we can go back that far. Let's but just that's watch right. that save again. Let's watch it again. It's all right. Oh my. Pump this save into my veins. The wherewithal that after you made the save, knowing you're about to go into Listen, the net. And it was a great move by Gerger, though. Yeah, it was almost like you jumped in, jump in the water with your phone and you got to make sure it stays <laughs> under while you're but, scrambling. But that situation right there, it's a typical Tommy Tartaglioni save. He, he's going oh, here crazy. You go, George. But oh, here's the play, here's the play. Can we stop it real quick? All right, so hit me here. Hit me here. <laughs> Folks, talk to me online. Tartaglioni comes down. Can you roll it back just a little bit? Give me that play one more time. There we go. Right here. And I'm going to have you stop at the same spot. Stop. Stop. Now, if you see this play, if you see this play, Tommy Tartaglioni comes out of the net and falls. He falls into the defenseman's legs. There is no goaltender interference. He is then at that point, the defenseman is outside of the crease. So there cannot be goaltender interference because the defenseman did not initiate it. Tommy Tartaglioni then goes to punch the defenseman with his blocker so he's still out of the play and we can roll the rest of it. And then a smart shot goes in the net. So if you wanted to know what happened on that play, there was no goaltender interference. The right call was made. But in any event, Tommy Tartaglioni comes up with a big save. Yeah, JP, that's it JP Susco, game. goalie in the Pro Division, just texted me and said that's a typical TNT play. Refs know that he plays like that. He initiated contact and flopped. So Make yep. total six, but let us know. Right. Let us know. You let just saw know. it. Yep. Tell yeah. us, goaltender interference or not. Ben Paglia already says it's all on the goalie. Uh, refs know how he flops. Typical TNT play. That's, of course, of course. So, George, why don't we pop in here? Get over I here mean, with me. I guess why we not? could, Why not? I haven't Jeff. seen this all day. I'm in my Reekster stuff, but I guess we could. Why not? Oh, my goodness. How beautiful is this? My goodness. But, yeah, listen. See how close to the camera we almost got killed by I know, right. I know. But, listen, text me. Or if, if you have my number, I'm not giving it out. Tweet us. Instagram. That play right now was probably so far the most controversial play in the Palma Pro Division. But Absolutely. But it's, it's one of those situations where the referees got it right. And you know yeah. I get on referees all the time. But this time they got it right. Hey, you're, you're hearing it now, refs. Don't yeah. ever say that he didn't give you credit because he's done it like four exactly. times. Has he trashed now, you a little bit? Yeah. That, might be, the, that might be the end of it for this tournament. I'm not, I'm not going to give you credit all tourney. But Tommy Tartaglioni initiated the contact there. He did. He initiated the contact. And I know, Pomp, you have to do that. You have to play that game with the referees. But hopefully they go back and watch the analysis of this play and they find out that the, 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 the contact was initiated by Tommy Tartaglioni. You know the boys are coming and checking SWH Live you after know the game. You know it. You Especially know if they it. did they something to. sick. DNT's going to watch that play, so he's oh, going to watch this whole thing. Of course he is. Hey. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep I'm gonna keep calling out what guys and I think that's Susco there. Susco, Joe Simpson said, uh, no interference. And I haven't gotten anything yet. And Tommy Nostromo said, I agree with Susco. So I haven't gotten anything yet that said it was goal turner interference. Good goal, but that was, of course, a controversial play, a bang bang play. But the referees got it right in that situation. And they got the second one right in the shootout. Referees doing a great job here. How many times have you heard me say that? Man.
Listen, we're gonna step. I know, right? I'm. I'm He's I'm okay, sick. folks. He's okay. I'm sick. No we're COVID. Gonna... He's good. <laughs> I'm gonna take a break here because I need a break before this next game. He's just trying yeah, to go get some more dinner over there. You're. Right. I didn't even get my first dinner. Oh. Well, Ed, well, you gotta go then. I gotta go. We don't need a hangry George Brown. All right. We're out of here. One, two, three. Let's go. <laughs> 